Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Trufin at the Babbling Belgian, and this is The Last of Us Part 2. So, last time we've uh, discovered all of these buildings, cleared them out, which I had to redo after reloading my save file for some reason, because that's apparently how The Last of Us rolls for a little bit. But uh, other than that, we are going forward. So, last time we met uh, Jesse, Jesse joined the gang, and then we left Jesse along with Dina, so we could head out on our own again. Doesn't really make that much sense, but uh, yeah, there we have it. Some more scraps over here and rags. I'm pretty well stocked at the moment. I'm gonna have to, yeah, I don't need to sneak right now. And there's another kitty cat. Is there another pet store nearby, maybe? Doesn't really look like it. Um, can I enter the parking lot over here? Parking garage, doesn't seem like it. But there is a truck on the sides here that we could check out because it's opened up. Um, so let's do that. And there's a, just another canister, which is fine. Um, yeah, because I can't really call it a bottle, now can I? Because the bottles are used for something else. Can I go into this building? Because this looks fancy. It is locked, Denied. but I think if we go up the truck, we might be able to get there. So like this, and then like this, and then we're going to have to see, because I'm expecting this to be full of infected. Uh, is there an open window over there? It doesn't seem like it, so it does, it's not going to help us here. Uh, so let's just smack it. This is, okay, kind of a creepy hotel. Is the hotel room over here open? Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, let's go check that out first then. Just to do this in a sort of order, because I think if I just run and jump, there we go. Uh, doesn't seem like there's anything in there. So let's just smack that as well. We're making a lot of noise, but... But now it seems like we're alone. And there's nothing here. Well, aside from all the resources. So uh, let's grab all that. Because it's going to come in handy if we bump into any of those scars. But there's a letter here as well. So, darling, I got everything packed. But Fedra, Fedra's already starting to put people on buses. And I have no idea where you've disappeared to. If I'm gone before you get back, I stashed a few of my things in the safe. Maybe an overabundance of caution... But Fedra has been confiscating things due to quarantine. All smells fishy to me. Combination is set to our wedding date. I mean, it's been 30 years, but I assume you remember when that was, right? See you soon. Love, Ellen. Okay. So 30 years from their wedding date. And I'm assuming we're going to find a clue around here somewhere about when that wedding date was. Because otherwise... Yeah, I'm actually completely full up on everything. Because I can't even craft a... Yeah, I can't even craft a silencer anymore. So I think I'm just going to craft some more arrows. No, I don't need to yet. I don't need to yet. My resources aren't up to full, so I don't need to. can pick up the racks, so that's that. And we can open this door. It almost sounded like I heard somebody breathing. That's why I stopped. So that's the safe. But... If you're lucky, the wedding date is actually marked over here. So 30th anniversary, there we go. 8th of October 2013, but it was 30 years ago, so it's 1983. Uh, so it's going to be 83, so it's 30, 3008. Or how do you guys do that? Because it's otherwise, it's, no, it's going to be 08. It's going to be 100883. 10, 08, 83. And that's it. There we go. Figured it out. We are smart. Like very, very smart. That's a lot of pills, actually. That was 24 pills in one go. Um, and we get another trading card over here as well. And that is the star sign trading card. Let's take a look at that. He is growing like plants out of his stomach. Okay. 
Zhang Lei. Okay? Don't mean to know who that is referring to, but that is that, I suppose. Is that more rags? Yeah. Can't really use that. But the, the safe was a nice touch, so moving on. Man, the city's still filled with supplies. Yeah, indeed. So we're at the uh, apartment at the other side of the other, uh, the previous one. The other side of the hallway. And it is indeed still filled to the brim with supplies. So we're even full up on bombs now as well. And I don't think I can actually make any of them anymore. So yeah, we're full up on everything. So I'm going to craft some more arrows. Since we're uh, picking up some binding and uh, scissors as well. Sharp things. What were they actually... Oh, they were rationing water. That was what they were doing. And there is a workbench over... Ooh, what's this? Wait, I thought there was something underneath that. Apparently not. Some sort of letter, but... So that's a workbench. Are there any... Ooh. This is dark all of a sudden. Any parts around here anymore? Maybe some more pills in the bathroom? There's one closed off door here, so I don't know... How we're going to be entering that is, yeah, doesn't seem like there's a way into that room. So let's use the workbench. Oh, 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 Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ. Okay, that scared the fucking shit of me. And there we go. Jesus. There we go. Well, you can go to hell. Jesus Christ, that was... Holy fuck. That was horrifying. Thanks for that, by the way. <laughs> oh, i just, just just chilling at the workbench. You you know why I'm out there, right? Okay, here we go. Yeah, eat it, dickhead. Uh, there was another bottle over here, right? God Jesus. damn. Fuck people. How the hell did he even get in? That was absolute horseshit. The door is locked. Come on. Ow. They wait, where did what the fuck were they doing by the way? Were they in this room with four people? Were they having I'm not even gonna think about this. So let's try this again. God damn. My heart. Um so I was just checking out what upgrades I could do. Um there are upgrades so i think if i can do a stability upgrade on the bow so that's decreasing weapon sway that's going to be really useful so that's basically replacing the grip so we're going to have some fancy plastic adjustment there or leather ah that seems to be leather just for better grip that's nice um and then i think i should probably try and upgrade the capacity on the bolt action rifle i know i talked about putting a scope on this thing but yeah let's just start with an extra magazine there we go so that also increases the reload speed of this thing and gives us six bullets in a single clip there we go there we go very nicely done so let's reload this thing which now includes six bullets which is very very nice okay uh, we also use the shotgun very, very shortly there. I'm going to attach the silencer back to the pistol because it gets removed every time you uh, you start a fight. And I should have probably used the bomb because there's enough explosive materials over here to just replace that. But, letter. Um, hey Melissa, I'm leaving this here in case you decide to join us after all. We're moving on from the safe house at first light. I've, ins I've stalled the others as long as I could, but Isaac has to be looking... For us by now, the fate of the last group of deserters is still fresh in our minds. The plan is still to head south and see if those rumors are true. Maybe it's all bullshit, but I'll take hopeful bullshit over Isaac's fanaticism any day of the week. Remember who we were, the WLF took us in, but they're not our people. I really wish you had left the stadium with us. Hope you still do, G-so. So... Ugh. You thought I was a wolf? Ah. Okay, so they tried to attack me because of that. But there's another skill tree over here, so a manual. Organic chemistry, Could concepts and practice. So let's put that away. And we get explosive upgrades. So that's another skill tree. And it seems to be the last, because now we don't have a lock symbol anymore. Explosive arrows. 
Craft arrows with explosive tips that deal massive damage in a blast radius. Rex triangle while aiming to switch arrow types. Explosives and binding. So it also increases the inventory capacity of the bombs and the explosive arrows if we go through this. Um, so these two are actually only 20 pills. So I'm actually going to grab those two. So the explosive arrows and the improved trap mines. And then... I think stability... What were we going for, actually? I think we were going to... Yeah, endure or not. So let's go with the smoke bombs. So blocks enemy line of sight. It's going to be handy. So then we can use listening mode to do that. But now... We can also make explosive arrows. I have explosives left, so might as well do that. I don't have enough adhesive anymore to make anything else, but maybe we can find some in this room. So that's 10 more pills. A health kit that we can't carry anymore. And 19 more pills. Okay, that might actually give us another upgrade. Yeah, so there we go. 100% movement speed, or there we go. Improved health kits. 50% more healing. That's gonna come in handy really, really nicely as well. Allows me to uh, take a bit more damage for the same health kit. And then we get two more revolver pistols. Re revolver pistols, revolver ammo and pistol ammo. So that is very, very nice. Nice room that these guys were holding up, to hold up in. But yeah, so that explains where they were coming from. So they were holed up in this room, um, hiding from the WLF. They are uh, deserters, but I, I was careful actually. Actually checked out listening mode before we went in there, but yeah, listening mode only seems to work if the game wants it to work, which is kind of sad, but gotta gotta go for it anyway. Okay, so that was a little bit of a fight, and there seems to be ooh, there seems to be a basement in here as well. Is this gonna be filled with infected? Let's see what they got in here. Yeah. Probably more resources. <laughs> oh, crap. Alcohol and rags that I can't use. And other than that. Nope. Canisters I can't use. And I can't make any more bombs. So yeah. The canisters are completely useless to me at the moment. I'm completely full up on that. So that's. Yeah. There's a tiny bit of resources in here. That's basically it. There's nothing else in here. Would have loved some more crafting parts of pills. But nope. No such luck. So, uh, moving back out of the building, I don't even know which door this is. Jesus. Okay, so that would have also set off the, uh... Unless that is now drawing infected over here. That would have also set off the WLF deserters upstairs, probably, but... Right now, yeah, they're not... They're not troubling us anymore. Because they're dead. Kinda whacked them with an axe. So. Do not block 25 hour access required. Um, there's more ways up there, but I don't think we need to go up there. Because we've seen everything in the house. So well, not the house, the, the apartments. Street. Yeah, the street is basically blocked off, so we're going to have to go over there now. Across this gate. I don't know what this building is supposed to be, actually. It looks kind of like a government building. So no parking, it's a loading dock. All right. And now we get to this area. Is this openable? Uh. Nope. So we're gonna probably have to find a way to... Yeah, there's a dumpster behind the gate here. But I'm guessing this place is gonna be filled with infected. Usually these abandoned... Um, dark open areas contain infected. But it seems like, yeah, listening mode isn't interested at the moment. So let's just act like nothing's happening. But we need to open up that gate first. We'll not be able to push that open, so okay. Okay, okay, okay. Ah, I think I know what to do. We can probably put the dumpster over here and let gravity roll it underneath the gate while we keep it open manually. That's, that's fine. That's fine. We'll do that in a second. Just checking for, uh, for resources. But first, I think there's even a puzzle in this puzzle. Because if I put this over here, like over here, just on the corner, and then climb on top of it, and then over here, there we go. There we go, shotgun ammo. Oh, we're, 
Oh, okay, never mind. I kind of knew that, but we're full up on shotgun ammo as well. So, that gives us the idea, of course, to put this dumpster all the way up top and then open up the gate. So, line that up just a little bit, like over here, and then, yeah, okay. Let's just open that up. There we go. And there we go. Yes, it did. Because we are a smart girl. Yeah, there we go. I know she would tell us to be smart. We are very smart. We figured that out in one go. We didn't need 10 minutes to figure that out. Until the next puzzle that is, then I'll probably need 10 minutes to figure that out. Can I open this up now? I don't know why I would, but... I mean, can't hurt to leave a way out, just in case I get stuck here. I'm gonna have to take an eye out for, keep an eye out for traps. Oh wow, look at that! There's the hospital. Fuck. Thought I'd be closer. That looks really, really cool, by the way. Aha! So this is the Seattle Conference Center. Ellie actually put something down in a journal. Lake Hill Seattle Hospital, I think this is it. Watch for the big red sign. Okay, so that's that, I suppose. So there doesn't seem to be anybody in here, so I might as well smash the window. Although it feels like a combat arena, though. Feels like there might be people coming in any second now. Um, I'm actually gonna swap. Can I swap this out? Oh. Can I swap this out for the bow? So right now we're using... Is that normal arrows? No, that's... That's normal arrows. Should probably keep an eye out on the normal arrows first. So it seems like the explosive arrows actually... We only get one for each time we craft them. Which kind of makes sense. I'm just going to run as long as there are no enemies. Otherwise I'm going to destroy Ellie's knees, I think. Okay, so there is a door over here, and I think I know how to reach that door. Because there are windows over there, so if I use one of the bottles I still have, and pulls that through, we can now just climb into that top area. There we go. Nice. And then gets me into this little office area. And there's plenty of bottles over here to just replace the one I, uh, I just lost. There's a Molotov over here, a fully fledged Molotov. But again, I'm full up on everything, so I don't, don't need that. Oh, wow, a single scrap. A single piece of scrap. That was really, really generous of you, game. And another trading card. Arch Enemy. Arch Enemy, yeah. I don't know who Arch Enemy is supposed to be, but Marcus Fordham. That is Arch Enemy. I'm wondering if those are all developers, because I'm, I'm pretty sure they must be. But of course, I don't know everybody who works at Naughty Dog, so... All those references are going to go way over my head. So other than that, I don't think there are any interesting resources here. Not that I really need them. The only thing I might need is another uh, melee weapon. But uh, ooh, yeah, this seems, this seems like an ambush hallway. I'm just going to check over here at the end. I got my throwable equipped. And this... Oh god, that was loud. Ellie, for fuck's sake. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. This turned grim all of a sudden again. Oof, stinks in here. So that probably means corpses. Uh, but for now... They missed last words, but for now... Everything seems quiet. But now that we know the listening mode just works when it wants us to work, then um, I don't trust it anymore. There might be enemies in the next room and we just don't know about it. Yeah, I think I found the, the source of the smell here. There's oh. one eviscerated corpse, explosive materials, and what the fuck was that? So this guy, I think, shot himself again. I mean, I say again, but it's just because we've seen so many suicides already from people who were infected and then just decided to end it themselves. Two more bits of ammo. And bathrooms usually have... No, alcohol and rags, so that's, that's not interesting. 
Hello? Oh, oh what the fuck was that? Fuck me. And now, of course, listing mode doesn't work anymore. Yeah, fuck me indeed. Uh, don't tell me to shake the thing. Oh, damn. By the way, I, um... I did realize by by because I'm also playing the original one again just to refresh my mind a bit. Um, stalkers were actually in the original game, but they didn't really look like that. Um, they had a bit of a makeover in this game, and they seem to be a lot smarter than they were in the Not good. in the original game as well. Because he, the first one we fought, actually fought kind of intelligently. He dodged, he weaved, he tried to get around me. That is, yeah, so that's another corpse, Maybe and I got you. Too, too much ammo for me. So, I can actually choose which gun to fire at the moment, because I, I, I have plenty of ammo for everything. I don't trust this anymore. That guy just peeked. He was lying on the floor as well, by the way, so he's sneaking. Which is why I probably didn't, can't hear him, so to speak, because he's... Sneaking around, so I can't really use listening modes. I'm just gonna have to be careful. I have my oh no, this is a dead end. This is a dead end. He can't have gone anywhere. So either he went out the back. Oh, great. Is he in the closet? No. Oh, this isn't good, is it? Oh wait. Oh wait, I can go over. Oh, this is definitely not good. Oh, I don't want to do this. Why is the camera pointing down? No, no. Oh, fuck's sake. That was... That was horrific. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, listening mode doesn't work on them. Oh, why didn't it give me the Molotov option? I should probably not be... Walking around with a Molotov. Okay. They probably also can't. Get outside. Damn. Okay. This just turned. Yeah. Crawl. Uh. Crawlers. I just called them crawlers. That's probably a bad, a better name for them. So stalkers are a lot smarter now. They um. They know how to sneak. They know how to stay out of sight. I'm gonna be so boned. And if for some reason I have. Yeah, let's just get the pistol out. It's a load of mushrooms. So there was one. There was one. There we go. That was in the face. So there were three of them. You saw there were three of them. They do still make noise though, so it is... I don't know why listening mode wouldn't work, because they're definitely not quiet. Um, just looking around the offices just a little bit. I know I don't really need the resources right now, but... Still, there might be collectible parts or pills. So, they all went in different directions. So this is probably the furthest one to the left that we found. Oh, God damn it, alcohol. Well, this is, this is, this is absolutely nerve-wracking. So I think now... And there's the other one. They're actually taking cover, which is... Really creepy. I used my silencer before, but... There we go. Oh, they're sneaky bastards. I hear one behind me. I think the last one I can take out with a bottle. I think there's another one. There's definitely more. So I should have probably grabbed them there. Oh, for fuck's sake. The, the just the... 
Oh, stop breathing into my neck. Stop breathing into my neck. This is horrible. I think there's two, because I hear female breathing yeah, and screaming, and then male breathing and screaming. So I think... I'm pretty sure I should probably grab the Molotov. There he is. Oh, no. No. Grab the Molotov. There he goes. And then go over to the revolver. And then I should probably... I'm gonna make one immediately because I'm full up on these things as well. I wonder if they actually see the flashlight because I feel like they do. Yeah, kind of missed his head there, but... There we go. Okay, so that's the noise of her dying. So that was three more. And there we go. And then I need to turn around. Oh. And there we go. That's the end of our melee weapon. That's not too bad. Can probably just use the knife if I want to as well. Okay. Okay, the axe broke. And ooh. There's a lot of explosives over here. Could have used those as well, because I think the these bombs might be just as effective. If it can manage a hit. I have not discovered half of the areas here. I've not uh, looted any of them. Because I'm just so on edge. I don't hear anything anymore, though. So I'll just deal with that when it comes. This area is huge, by the way. So there's a lot of stuff around here. Um, kind of filled back everything that we've spent, aside from, of course, the bullets. That looked kind of like a clicker there, but it's just the shape of the, the mushrooms on the wall. And other than that, yeah, this place looks horrible, by the way. Did I ever go in here? I think I did. Yeah, that's the, the cafeteria. We've been there, so I think I've checked every single part of this building. Um... Now, I'm supposing I need to break a window here to get out. Like this. Ooh. That's a nice river. But I'm assuming this was not a river before. That is pretty cool. But also very, very loud. So if I'm yelling, that's because of that. I want to get over the noise of the... The river, because it's very, very loud. Um, I could probably jump the gap. Oop. There we go. Ooh. So there's a room over here, but it drops down immediately. So I should probably just check upstairs first. Just for anything useful, like a bottle. Well, we have a bottle, so that's not a problem. And yeah, that seems to be everything there is. So we need to go back into the building. Yeah. Put the words right into my mouth, Ellie. And we're gonna drop down immediately. That's probably gonna be another, another fight. So now there are other infected here. This place is uh, not doing well, is it? I saw like a pop-up for a second there, but um, no, it's probably just a graphical glitch. Oh, shotgun ammo. Shotgun ammo. Okay, let's remember that. Uh, according to the game, I should be able to see something. But no, the game was auto-locking on an enemy through the wall. Okay, fair enough. Okay, so there is one over there. Can he go through here? No, 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 stop, stop manhandling me. Okay, that's a clicker. That's a clicker. I think he... Okay, never mind. Okay, thanks for that, I suppose. Uh, I should probably grab that one bullet that was over there. I'm assuming it's a, a single bullet. Oh, hi. 
Yeah, okay, that was the weapon I had at hand there. Um, where is that gun? Oh, it's probably over here. There we go. There's another one. There we go. Stab it in the face. Okay. I feel like I'm getting resourceful enough with my uh, equipment here. Time to go. Time to go indeed. I should make another Molotov. Just to have that. And you know what? I can actually make another silencer as well. Um, let's grab this then. And then the shotgun. The shotgun shell. Which allows me to reload this bad boy again as well. And there's another bottle. Okay, so basically, I have my Molotov back, I have one bullet back, and I have a bottle back. So, didn't really lose many resources aside from, again, those revolver shots. Which is annoying, but it is what it is. Let's reload the pistol again. And I don't know if I need to reload anything else, no. I should probably try and use the bow a bit more. Especially, but I think the stalker actually spotted me before I spotted him. So that wouldn't have helped. Okay, looting again. So I think I must have lured every enemy. Every enemy? What the hell was that noise? I heard like a, a dull crash in the background. Just in case you guys missed it. Yeah, there's definitely some low... Low bass coming through in the audio right now there's definitely something moving around it's probably behind that door i feel like this area is a bit too big for the amount of enemies that we've seen here oh uh, is this gonna be a bloater fight this is gonna be a bloater fight isn't it um let's open up the door here we go oh this is gonna be bad Oh. oh, okay, okay, oh crap, nope, 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 stalker get out, stalker get out, and there we go, in the river, do I need to do anything, oh he's still here, okay, never mind, stab in the neck, Okay. Oh, this is bad. I can't really do anything at the moment, I suppose. We're just going with the flow. Oh, no. That is... Ah! Ow. 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 That sounded like we got roughed up a little bit, but my health seems to be okay. Oh, this is not good. Why are we here? Fuck Seattle. Okay. Is that a statement from uh, Alia from Naughty Dog? Fuck Seattle. Okay, so that is locked. Oh, man. Now we're in a dark place. Now we're in a very dark place. Aha. Okay, never mind. I can probably get through here. That must have been really gross, by the way. Really, really gross. Oh, mushroom. Oh! Nope, nope, nope. There we go. Knew I just picked up a bottle. Damn, lady. Ooh. Yeah. That was creepy how she just came out of the walls. That is... Yeah, um, the, the Last of Us is definitely a horror game, by the way. It might not be marked as such. But it definitely is a horror game. Um, what do we have? Might as well make another explosive arrow. Oh. There we go. I don't like how it just automatically equips the last thing you crafted. Because 9 times out of 10 it's not necessary to equip the thing you just, uh, you just crafted. So that's that, but that was just some optional stuff. So I'm thinking... We're gonna have to dive to see... If there's anything we can use around here, I should probably grab one of the... Yeah, let's just grab one of the bricks over here. 
There we go. And at least we have a throwable. Aha, but it seems like we can go up there as well. So no diving required over here. Just need to go up top. And then see if we can't move around this area. There we go. Now we're moving forward. Making progress and all. Okay. So the side of the sewers, but again, this is a sewer level. I hate sewer levels. Sewer levels are usually devoid of uh, many resources and at the same time filled with enemies. So that is, I think, why, they, why they're not fun. Get well. me the hell out of here. Oh, there's gonna be... There's gonna be people waiting here for me, aren't there? This is like the, one of those scenes where you can see the end of the ladder that allows them to just pop up, but I feel like this crate is not gonna be open. Ah, it is. Oh, but that's making a lot of noise. Yeah, it's making a lot of noise. She's gonna get thumped in the face. That was loud. I feel like we went down a lot more than we needed to go back up to get here again. This seems to be a train station? Yeah, rail tickets and fare cards. So, a train station. Train station in Seattle. Never been to Seattle before, so... I have no idea whether this is representational or not. So, let's see. Seems quiet at the moment. So I'm not going to care too much about squatting. Giving Ellie her daily exercise. But there we go. Is this... Okay. You are here. There's a lot of big trees. Ah, oh, we're in front of a park. So we're in front of a park. Cut through the park. Why? We're here and the hospital is over there. So that, that doesn't make any sense. We just need to go over there. Okay, no resources inside, so I'm gonna guess this is gonna be a stealthy mission. Yeah, okay. That was definitely somebody communicating to someone. Anybody whistling? I'm just gonna make Ellie really dirty at the moment, because that floor must be moist and everything bad around here. Oh, Jesus Christ! Wow, this... This game can sometimes just make you jump out of your chair. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, wow, 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 wow. Being impaled with an arrow will periodically damage you. Great. Okay, so they're whistling to one another. I need to move back. I'm gonna have to move, move back here. Can I actually see them? Yeah. So I think there's three of them. I only see two at the moment, but... I can probably grab... This one? Um, I still have a silencer on. There we go. So we killed two. And there's another one over there. So she's probably trying to whistle to her pals. There we go. Oh, there's another one. And we got a melee weapon. Where's the, the other one? I can hear her or him. Okay, that arrow just kind of spooked me completely. I'm, uh... I don't trust anybody any anymore. Where is she? Ah, there. Seems like a him, though. Or maybe there are two and I just missed one. There we go. Okay, that was a good shot. So I think that's it. At least for now. So we killed like four of them. We got the melee weapon out of that. I'm gonna have to be careful. I'm gonna loop around to the right side. No, there's definitely more. Okay. There's actually one really, really close by over here. 
There we go. Those faster style kills are really coming into their own. And there was another one. There was another one over there. I saw him or her. There we go. Silencer came into its own here. Jesus. These must be the scars. There's another axe on this one. No matter. Hospital. And more adhesive over here. I think I picked it up, right? You yeah. Better not have strung nor up. Okay. Um. Well, this is something new. Are there more of them? Because I feel like if Ellie starts talking to herself, I'm fine, right? Um, and we get rifle ammo. But we don't really need rifle ammo because we're full up on all of that. Now, what is this fire? That just seems like a regular campfire, fair enough. Okay, here's the road to the hospital. Okay, but there's plenty more to discover over here. Because, yeah, I could probably crawl over here, but where, where is... Oh, no. Can't even go through here, so it's definitely that way. This looks really, really good, by the way, with the fire and all that. It makes for uh, a very ambient scene of uh, change of scenery. And there we go. Another corpse. And Ellie writes something down, so let's read that journal entry. I'm hoping this is good. Uh, scars fuck these people. Stay focused on why you're here. So the hospital, we need to get that. I can actually swap this out because it's a better axe. It has an extra charge. Don't, no need to upgrade it just yet. We'll do that later on. And there we get another arrow. Definitely can use that. Although I think I can only carry like six arrows. Which is again... I mean... They don't really take that much space in your backpack. Just stick another one of them in. Um, but the garden suites. Let's go in. Oh, this is going to be loud again. That seems way too loud. All right. Everybody knows we're in. You know what? Before we head further into the garden suites, I'm going to take a little break. Because, uh, yeah, I'm kind of on edge. We had a lot of jump scares here. And, um, yeah, I wanted to play this... A little bit this morning to to chill out a little bit doesn't didn't really help but thank you guys enormously for watching hope you guys enjoyed this episode of the last of us part two and when we get back we'll continue exploring the guarding suites and probably killing a lot of scars so uh thanks again enormously for watching and see you guys next time goodbye